Striker, you know, I guess he's come out of down to Jackson a couple times and trained. I unfortunately never never trained with the guy I would like to. That would have been fun. But uh, don't know much about him, of course. You know, you guys are going to ask me, what do I know about John? I know nothing. Haven't seen any footage on him. Haven't seen any of his fights. Um, it's kind of the way I like it anyway. So go in there and just do what Cal was going to do and fight my ass off for everybody. Didn't even, wasn't even, wasn't even a, an option. So uh, probably should have been my coaches and my management team especially was like, what? Because I said yes before I even talked with them. So they were, you know, so Kevin and, oh yeah, oh yeah. And Josh and, and Kevin were like, dude, what? And I was like, hey man, you got, you, you know, signing with me that there was going to be some, some craziness going on, but uh, they were just like, they were like, why would you jeopardize not a title shot? You know, why, 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 why was the question? And even Greg was like, cowboy, bro. And I was like, Greg, come on, man. You know how, how we do it. So uh, everything was okay. And they were like, after this win, just, just please wait. And I said, Greg, Dos Santos might not be ready till you know, end of the year, November, December, so who knows? I don't know. You know, when Dana called me, I, I almost like went into tears like, Dana, man, if you knew what I went through getting ready for this fight, the injuries and the, you know, it's just like, man, damn it, it just sucked. So I put a lot of money into this camp and getting ready. So for me just to tell my coaches and all my training partners, hey guys, sorry, no payday today. We just going, you know, that, that that's tough. So. Uh, we're taking the fight, and we'll fight him, I'm sure. He ain't going nowhere. He's still ranked high up in the organization. You know, he's going to heal up, and we'll fight. Yeah, absolutely. You know, he was in the gym training with us, you know, asking us if we need anything, you know. So my this is my talk on John Jones. Had the cameras and the spotlight been on me when I was doing all my screwing up, it would have been – I'd be in a lot of trouble. People would be like, God, you're a degenerate. You're an idiot. Now they, they say that anyways, but uh, – you know, the, the attention is crazy. Just like I was, I was telling you know, a reporter, I got punched in the mouth at a Whole Foods, knocked my glasses off my head. A guy, you know, I was texting on the phone, walking across the cross rock, me and Lindsay, guy honking. She's like, you know that guy? I said, I don't, I don't know who that is. I just didn't pay attention. I went to my car. They come running over, running their mouths, and dude just smoked me and blew my glasses off my face, and I was fucking livid, man. I just seen fire in my eyes. I look at Lindsay. And now where I am having to deal with all the, you know, the boat incident of me going through all this, you know, I just bit the bullet. I told the dude, today is your, today is your lucky day. And he goes, yeah, I bet it's my fucking lucky day. And I was like, dude, if you touch me again, I, I'm not going to be able to control it. But I'm going to bite this bullet. I'm going to get in my car and we drove away, you know. So just the maturity of, of where I am now and, and being in the public eye now, I can't just, when I'm driving my truck and, and I road rage, I want to get over and beat people up all the time. But, you know, I just can't do it. So, you know, John is just young. He's got a lot of money and making the mistake, you know, should, sure, he should have hired a driver. Absolutely. But he didn't. And, and now, you know, just he's in the public eye, so it's, it's, it's tough. And um, like I said, just the maturity of where I am now, being able to, to not make those bad decisions, I guess, is, is where I am today. So, which is good. You know, two years ago, I would have definitely made bad decisions. So, uh, I don't know. He's going he's gonna to bounce back.